Mm-hmm. Okay, well then. I need to keep my armies together. I keep being too ambitious, too, um, you know, stretching too thin. It's not working out very well. It's not working out very well. Yesterday I was a bit behind. I wasn't too far behind, I don't think, but I was definitely a bit behind. Okay. We can't let them get any more forts. Or at least I'd really like to not let them do that. This is our siege one. There we go. Let's set up like this. And the good thing is France is, you know, France is on our side. So it, the longer we wait, the more chances it gives them to just start smashing up people. Like the Papal State, for instance. Okay. No, 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 no. Don't go there. Hmm. Who are Austria's allies? Um. Not that many. Uh, the Scotland, one province minor. Papal State, one province minor. Tuscany. That's the big one, Tuscany. You know? Tuscany is pretty powerful, actually. That's about it, though. That's about it. Salzburg as well. What, you know, who cares? We gotta get this war goals, it is my thought, my thinking. So, um. Yeah, I think we spread out like this and just hunker down and be ready to reinforce if we need to. I think it's about all we can do, so. Yep. Yeah. Alright, well. Let's see what we got going on here. They're suffering attrition there. Mm hmm. I don't. I don't like just leaving, letting them do this. Well, we have to go around anyway, so we shouldn't, because then we won't be able to... Yeah, no, 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 just let them take it back. Whatever. Whatever, man. You do you, Austria. You do frickin' you. Holy crap, Georgia has a 17 stack now? Wow. They are a march, so that makes sense, but still. It's impressive. It's impressive. Yes. Get the Papal State out. Cool. Oh no, Paris is getting sieged down. Man, Austria is strong. This is why we really need to just get one solid war and cripple them in it. We just haven't been able to do that. And that's the point of this war. We have to be able to win it to do that. Yeah, so that sucks. Oh, they got, they got Paris. Yeah, they did. Wow. France, you are doing terribly, man. I thought you were supposed to be strong. France, you have like more more troops than me, around the same amount. How are you sucking so much? And this is the downside of upgrading my forts, is that now it's working against us. Hmm. Okay, at least George is doing some good work now. Oh yeah, look at that. Holy crap, I'm just gonna do that. Look at that, that's gonna be a win. Beautiful. You know what? It might be good to take Defender of the Faith. I haven't been considering that, but... Missionaries, morale of armies, morale of navies, not the war of uh, Well, we don't need missionaries right now, so I guess maybe not. But, but still, I mean, like, you know, it's worth considering. Unfortunately, I think George's tech is down, but no, nope, they're still doing all right. I bet you they're going to come attacking here. I bet you that's what they're doing. No, really? Okay, I mean, that's awesome that they're not. Um, oh, no. Darn. Uh, I mean, that's still good, but probably not going to be relevant. We're not going to be annexing any vassals anytime soon. I really need to get the war goal. I really need to get the war goal. Water shortage is good, don't get me wrong, but we really need to get Paris back, too, but that's on France, you know? Still, it's early on in the war, so they shouldn't dip out yet. I doubt they would do that.
I'm gonna develop, yeah. You are correct. I was just kind of waiting, but I should do it before I forget. That's fine. Let's not do any more than that. <laughs> yep, develop a, a lot of stuff. And I have Georgia on defensive duty, which I think is actually pretty good, especially in this war. I think it'll be really, really nice. I'm not moving these armies, though. You might be saying, like, oh, you should go over there and do another siege. But no, then I wouldn't be able to make it back in time. And I have to get this. This siege is super important. It's the war goal, for one. Gosh darn it, though. France is just getting beaten up. Wow. We need to cripple Austria in this war. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, we got the war goal. Perfect. Perfecto. We've got the war goal. And so, so now that that lends us a little bit more flexibility. Yeah. Donji Kraji is only a... Uh, fort level one. Yes, exactly. And if, and if France gets pieced out, then hopefully at least it's after they, uh, you know... Act as a good punching bag for a while, yeah. Okay. Okay. France, if anything, I, I just want you to do one thing for me, France. Please just get Tuscany out. That would be beautiful. If you could just get Tuscany out of this war. So I'm not going to be able to go down there, honestly, on my own. I'm not going to be able to do that reasonably. Um... I need all my armies here, front and center, you know? Hmm. Okay, walls breached. Good. Good. Oh, thank you. That's lucky. Okay. Not even gonna risk it yet. Just stay nearby. Stay within two provinces. This is reconquest, yep. Because it's for Hungary. Hungary has claim, or cores almost everywhere. Unfortunately, they lost all their Croatian stuff, which I would have gotten this time, because it's really, that would have been nice, but unfortunately, they lost it. But still, they have all their other ones, um, including their Slovakian ones. So, so yeah, I mean, they have a lot of cores that we're going to get back. And if we get, that means they're going to be really cheap, and they won't give me hardly any aggressive expansion, right? And then, it it's a lot of good land, too, so it should hopefully cripple Austria, or at least really hurt them, you know? If we take all those cores, which we're probably not going to be able to take all of them, but... Should be able to get a lot of them. Do that, yeah. And then I think we go up here into these mountains. Something like that. Carnton would be really good to get. Very tactical location, strategic location. Okay. Mm-hmm. We're about to be able to get our last idea. It's costing a little extra than normal, but the discipline and artillery combat ability is so worth it. You kidding me? Beautiful. Uh, also, we could take some other stuff. Um, I don't think this is actually that good. It's alright. But definitely we should take this. It's free, you know. Might as well take it for now. Um, beyond that, though, just having discipline and artillery combat ability go up with one fell swoop is amazing. It's incredible. Good. That means our army should be a lot less likely to get smacked around like they have been. Yeah, France gets pieced out. It's not a huge deal. The only bad thing would be if they break our alliance with them. That would that would suck. Uh, I tell you what, we should also. Ah, no, we can't do that really. I already have an admiral, so yeah. Hmm. All right, so I think I'm gonna actually put them on. We kind of have the defensive situation locked down. I'm gonna put you on siege. Uh, Georgia, I want you to siege down that. I don't care what Kiev goes for. Let them decide their own thing. I guess, well, Kiev, you go for that one. Yeah. You guys do that. Let's, And I'll hopefully try to shield you by doing my own siege here. 
Yeah, take you go there, and you go there. Cool. France, just distract their armies a little longer, bud. I promise. I promise, man. It'll only hurt a little bit. <laughs> go softly into that deep sleep, France. Okay. And how long do we have till tech? Not too long, so I, I shouldn't... Eh, yeah. I shouldn't bombard forts, but I might do Carnton because it's mountains, right? And we really need to get it. Vienna's farmland, so it's not going to be that bad if we have to fight there, but... Yeah. Oh, I feel like France is going to... No, they're actually at high, though. Ongoing battles is the, is the reason, though. Yeah, that ongoing battle. Wow, I think France is going to be piecing out soon. Hmm. That's really not good. Wow. 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 No. It's gonna be a while till we even have fifty points, mind you. Go ahead and just I'm gonna manually control these guys. We have the war goal though, you know. Yes, exactly. Once France gets out, it's gonna be good for us. Short term. So that is one positive. So I'm curious about this. Let's let's go ahead and do this. Yeah, let's let's try to do a sneak operation into. Uh... Oh, hey, Age of Absolutism. Okay. By the way, our golden age only lasts a couple more years, so that's not good. Mm hmm. I feel like. Uh... Oh, hold on. Our ruler's not that good. I feel like uh... it's a good idea to try this. Maybe. Maybe not. We'll see. Man, France, you're just not doing good engagements either. I think you kind of deserve the loss you're getting. I don't know, man. Okay, if we could just if we could just get Tuscany out, right? This is a risky operation. Don't get me wrong. I I understand the risk involved with this. This is bad. Okay, this is real bad. Oh no. Hmm. What do you think, wisely chosen? Do we go all in on the defense or the attack on Carnton, or do we go all in on Vienne? Take out of there and go to Vienne. What do you think? France is gonna peace out like very soon. I'm gonna leave this up to you, wisely chosen. I, I, yeah, Vienne is their capital. You're right. I just think that the mountain fort would be. The mountain fort would be really nice to have, and we're further along. But you know what? I think you're right, though. I think we gotta we gotta run. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's fair. For now, at the very least. Yeah, they were definitely going there. So. And this is the siege guy. So let's go ahead and take him over there. Oh, I'm really hoping these guys can get some sieges here. But unfortunately, I think they're going to try to thwart that plan. This is really risky, and I, I definitely shouldn't be doing this, but if we can do it, it will give us like a retreat spot, you know? Okay. Maybe we scared them away. No! Don't break the siege, you fools. Ah, oh, darn it. Uh, Diplorep is fine. That's a big fort. Wow, five. Level five fort. That makes sense. Totally makes sense. I just hate it. Hmm. Food shortage. Okay, so we have a... At least we have an occupation there. France has got to peace out soon, I'm thinking. Minus 17 reasons to stay in the war. <laughs> That's crazy. It's crazy. I've seen them. I've seen AI go out for like one reason, <laughs> negative one, and they'll go out sometimes. But all right, this is the problem, right? Is they're gonna come over here and do this? So we gotta retreat. This plan has failed. Mm-hmm. All right, get that siege soon. So that's good. Mm-hmm. Ah, 
darn. Alright, well, I was trying to sneak around. Not gonna work, apparently. Oh, hold on. We're not paused. Um... Hmm... 7%. They're at low enthusiasm, actually. Okay, that's, that's not good, Kiev. <laughs> that's not good. I'm not helping you there. Ooh, okay. Well, France actually... Oh, they gave him something, too? What? Okay, well. Oh, gosh darn. Come on! Give me some lucky rolls. That is not good. That's Woods. We can get a general in charge there real quick. I'm actually surprised they're going to try to do that. Really? They're still going to do it, huh? No, no, just go there for now. Okay, um... I, I don't know if we're going to win that one either way, though. It's still actually kind of a... That's kind of a toss-up, still. Uh, I tell you what it does let us do. Maybe do this. Okay, crossing and terrain. We outnumber them. They're bringing in more, though. And there's another whole army I saw, too. But, uh, yeah, I don't know about this. I don't know about this one. August 20th. 20th of August, we might... Ooh, ooh, that's rough. Look, look at that, though. 120% discipline. They have more morale. Why? Do they have... Austrian traditions, army traditions, oh gosh darn. I, I, I think we're going to win that one, but they might bring in enough reinforcements to turn the tide. Oh, we won it, nice. Beautiful. Okay, that's really important. That was very, very, very crucial. Um... I'm actually going to take all of our armies and just group them all up on the capital because I'm, I'm not risking <laughs> I'm not risking letting them catch us off guard or something. Just attrition? Whatever. What's attrition? This is the problem. They're going to be coming back down here now. Mm-hmm. Hey, Tuscany. You want to get out of this war, bud? It's not actually ridiculous to think that they might. In fact, go down there and smash those navies if we can. <sighs> oh my. Okay, we're gonna catch that one, that's good. Be watching that army though. 49%, come on, let's go! Oh, we got that one too, Semlin. Oh, yo, that's beautiful. Okay, this is good. This is actually pretty darn good. In fact, I think I'm gonna be able to catch this army. <laughs> I'm gonna be able to sack wipe them. I think it's actually a decent possibility. Well, we've—I think we've won this war either way at this point. We've—we've uh, we've proven ourselves to them in on the field of battle. Twenty-two percent exactly. Look at that. Even more now. We have the war goal too, mind you. Okay, definitely. Uh, take this off for March. Cool. Um, what do we do now? I think we now play the defensive, right? And we start sieging down stuff. Recover a little bit, you know. Siege stuff down. And we see if we can piece uh, Tuscany out. Yeah, I didn't think so. Yeah, this is the problem, right? And now we're kind of trapped here. My navy left. Okay. Best thing we could do is go up in the mountains and hide. siege now, yeah? Okay. Actually, you know what I think the best thing we could do is actually, is this. I changed my mind.
Let's try to just, you know, focus on stuff here. Maybe we just peace out, I don't know. Stuff is, I mean, that's the thing, is the stuff here is gonna be pretty cheap. I wanna give them pest back now, I wanna give them their capital. I feel like they would appreciate that. And then Temesh, stuff with forts, you know. I mean, we should definitely keep going. Look at our manpower, we have so much manpower. <laughs> We have so much manpower. Uh, I feel like we should do this, maybe. Smash that army up real quick. Cool. Do that. Hmm. Do not let them get Vienna back. Do not. I don't care what it takes. We do not want to let them take Vienna back. Mm-hmm. Okay, apparently you need to be there. Hey, ay, 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 ay. Hmm. Let's try to get Tuscany, uh, get Naples back. Cool. Um, okay. Twenty-first. Alright, hold on. These two. One, two. Twenty-fifth, twenty-fifth. One, two. Alright, let's fight. Let's fight. This is bad. They're probably gonna go and attack me in Naples. Which I absolutely hate. Uh, so this is not a great battle. They have a level three general, three star general. Oh, gosh darn it, you gotta be kidding me, really? I, I could have looked too, I knew that my rebels were gonna fire. I it would have it notified me. I just must not have seen it. Because I'm a dummy. Okay, I think now what we want to do is go like this, this, this. Okay, yeah, like that. There we go. That really sucks. Hold on, hold on. Oh, oh, genius, genius plays here. Watch, watch this, watch this, watch this. Watch this. <laughs> you fools! <laughs> Fight my rebels for me! <laughs> yo! Yo! Yo, guys, watch this. Oh my god, oh my god. This, this is... Oh, can we do it? I'm making them fight my rebels as a distraction. <laughs> and then... Then we hop on the boat. We hop on the boat. Go, go, go! <laughs> I can't believe that worked. I escaped. <laughs> I escaped them. Beautiful. I love it. I love it. That's so good. I made them fight my rebels while I used it as an opportunity to run out of the peninsula. Beautiful. That's so funny. Oh my god. I had to wait till he got locked on though and I wasn't sure if I would beat my rebels and then be stuck there, but no, it worked out. Uh, Georgia, it's not gonna matter because you're about to get beaten up, but I want that to be your objective instead. Really, Scotland? Really? Gosh darn it, that's annoying. Well, hold on. It's not that bad. Yeah, it's time to time to recover for a little bit of uh, our ships there. Oh, rip Georgia. Rip that army over on the left. Yep. Hey, they didn't get sack wiped. That's about the best I could have hoped for there. So, our siege phase is, um, yeah, see, it's this is why I have a um, spy network there. So I figured I might as well, I'm not doing much else, you know. I'm considering doing that, I think it might be good. This is a, a port and fort. It's mountains too, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm.
Okay, now that is a reasonable amount, I think. Salzburg. Nope, didn't think so. I really want to get Tuscany out, but we're going to have to put all of our armies focusing on that if we want to have a chance. Um, ah, oh, darn. Alright, if we can break their walls in this siege. If we get lucky or something, you know, we'll see. I need to see what happens here to know what we're, our plan is going to be. Uh, lose the prestige, obviously, yeah. Oh, okay, they broke it for every... We will, okay, we reached the walls. So we're definitely going to try to get the siege and out... You know, just hope we outpace them. We should be able to. No problem. Okay, meanwhile, uh, bring the army up here. I think we're going to need all our armies together soon. Okay. I don't know how much longer I'm going to... I'm going to stream for. But I definitely want to finish this war up. Okay, they're scrambling around. A chicken with their heads cut off. Right. We got a ticking war score. That is going to definitely help us out. They would give us a 40% right now. It's not bad. That's not bad. Okay, well. Right now we're just hoping we get this. together now so we're at a pretty defensible spot come on please yes oh that's so good that's beautiful we needed that okay at this point I think we might be good to peace out honestly I'm gonna take those two well I don't know it's a reconquest war let's not take those if we don't have to let's uh let's let's give stuff to Hungary so let's figure out what we want for Hungary I think we want Eisen marked Temesh Tontal. Yes, I see them. But if we want Budapest. As long as I can connect this up reasonably. Like that, you know? Yeah, return of course is gonna be cheaper. I think you're right, yeah. I mean that seems pretty good to me right there, you know? That seems pretty darn good. We get the fort there, which is the only fort in the whole like southern half of their country here, by the way. Uh, one reason it's been annoying. So we get that fort, we get pest, we get stuff to connect it. I think that's fine. Plus whatever else we can get, if anything. So let's sort by war score. Someone. So no, we can't get anything else. Uh, could we get that on top? That on top? No. Yeah, I think that's fine. I think we I think we get out of this war now. I don't think we're going to get much more benefit. Well, I guess there's nothing super pressing. We could keep going. We could keep going, right? Yeah, we should keep going, because otherwise we're just going to have to do a, probably a harder war later, because they're going to keep growing. They're probably going to re-ally Brandenburg. We should, do, we should do more. We should do more. I'm not sure how, but we're going to do it. We have plenty of manpower, too. We're absolutely doing great on manpower. That is interesting. That is a big army there, bud. That's a big Tuscan army. Are they going to attack me? They are. I am surprised. Um, We can reach... That's actually perfect for us, though. Hold on. We can at least see how this battle goes. 21st, 21st. Hold on. So you guys don't have to go for another two days. I want to make sure they get locked in, though. This is probably good now. 22nd. Oh, they got locked. Cool. Let's do this battle. I mean, oh, okay, who's our best general? Five maneuvers. So we only need. I think this guy's actually better. Um, yeah. 
I'm almost certain he is. Uh, hold on. We got some stuff we can do. No, oh, he's not that good. Wait. Yeah, he's not that good. Darn. Alright, boys. Well, nice knowing you. Okay. We have superior discipline. Inferior morale. Superior tactics. Superior troops. Troop layout. And we outnumber them. They have a crossing. They... We're also going to have reinforcements from Georgia. Oh, we're going to win this. Yo. And then, I think they're going to get locked in. Oh, they didn't get locked. They didn't even make it. Wow. Okay, that was good. That was good. Absolutely good. We're not, we're not even going to get an attrition tick from that, I don't think. Cool. If anything, maybe we do like this. Just smash up this army. Yeah, it's a terrible idea. That's a terrible idea. Who are we kidding? What do we want to do now? For one, I'd love to get Tuscany out, but there's no way we do that without... Yeah, no, we can't take anything. Well, they occupy Naples, right? That's the reason why they're not gonna... We're not gonna be able to do anything there. I feel like this is a fine war to stay, at, stay in for longer, though. This is an important one. We need to stay in as long as we can to get everything we, we're gonna need. I think what we want to do is take this guy here... No, but I don't want to do that. No, let's just split it up for a second. Or let them run into me. Sure. <laughs> if you want to do that, bud, be my guest. Uh, this one might actually be tougher. But I think they've already collapsed their first line. I don't think they're going to be able to recover it. Well, I don't know. They keep throwing more and more into the fire, but yeah, I was going to say I don't think they're going to I don't think that's going to matter. Wow. I'm surprised they did that at all though. Wow. So on that one to go there, that one there, that one, that one. There you go. Boom. That was pretty good. Good set of battles. Okay, nice. Um, hold on. Someone is being trying to be sneaky, sneaky beaky like. I wonder if I could. Oh, well, they're just gonna attack me there. I guess I see why we don't have a a general in charge. We have low morale. I guess I could see that. Okay, yeah, but no, you do not do that. You do not do that. That's that's also going to be bad if they do that one. Yeah, go away, Tuscany. Just stop bothering me. Just stop bothering me, man. Come on. Maybe I just do this. Uh, yeah, we'll do that. Honestly, This is a terrible idea. That's the honest truth. But honestly, we're going to do it. I'm going to hope we can just get it. If we can get it quick enough, it might be worth it. Ah, oh, gosh darn disease outbreak. We're suffering massive attrition, too. Gotta hate it. Still. It's alright. It's alright. I know it's a terrible idea. I know. Their armies are slipping through the cracks, too. I know. Not much I can do about it right now. Oh, that ah, that really sucks. Yo, Tuscany. Tuscany, my dude. Oh, yo, Tuscany's getting closer. Oh, snap. 
Let's see if we if we're able to blockade them enough. Maybe they'll maybe they'll jump out. No, gosh darn it! I was hoping that wouldn't happen. That was a good siege. We needed to keep that one. Are they really going to do that? That is annoying. Oh crap! They're gonna not make it before we get one last tick at the very least. But that's very annoying. They're probably going to win that, even. I don't know, man. I don't like this. Please. Shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is terrible. This is a bad, bad battle. But we won, apparently. Okay. Well, I guess I'm going to stay. I have no idea what to think of any of this. Oh no, that's not good though. That's probably gonna do it in for us for the for this for this this uh, series of engagements. Oh, that's probably why Tuscany is actually uh, just let it fight out. Honestly, we're doing a lot of damage to them. I'm curious to look at the losses on this battle overall. We still lost less than less than them. <laughs> so that was worth it in my eyes. Um yeah. Hmm, okay. Uh I'm curious if we can get Tuscany out. They have rebels, so absolutely we can. Heck yeah, bud, get Tuscany out. Beautiful. And then Naples, they actually had Naples, so that is lovely. Oh, Austria also has um, rebels. That's beautiful. Okay, well, that's definitely going to help. This is probably going to mean that we're going to be able to get a lot of stuff from them. Fight my rebels for me, yes. Well, actually, they're your rebels still, I guess, but, you know. Although they're going to they're gonna take over the siege, though. That's their plan. Hmm, yeah, I see. I see. I think we might want to peace out now. I don't know how much more war score we're going to be able to get. 55 is a good amount, too, so. Do we have the ticking war score? Almost fully, so. Hmm. Uh, I don't want to let them get that siege back. I think this is probably a good point, you know? Salzburg? Nah. Okay, let's let's peace out. I'm definitely not doing that mess of Patrick. I should have not looked. Um, so I want to do that, that. So marked. Torontal. Pest. Torontal. I wish there was a better way to sort this. There you go. Okay, cool. So then, I think then box. Well, let's look at like cheapest now. Semlin, well, oh, that's a fort too. You know what? That actually seems like a good idea because it is a fort. Yeah, we should work on one of our forts. So Trensen, if we can, and Spies, can we connect them up? Spies, I'm not sure how to pronounce it. <sighs> Yo, there we go. We get three forts and Pest. Could we go even a little further? Snoljok, Snol, Solnok. No. Okay, box. Well, let's see. Again, lowest first. Turda. That's funny. Name of province. Um. Okay. Yeah, I think this is good. All right, this is this is good. Let's get out. Yes. Look at that. Look at that mighty Hungary. Yo, we connected up all of Hungary's land. We got them back. Pest. Which they'll probably move their capital to. Uh, we also got them Zemplin, Trensen, and uh, Temis, all of which have forts. Although, did they delete that one? No, it's Mothball. Beautiful. Beautiful. Good stuff. Okay, we don't have anything to convert in our country, but we can actually help them convert some stuff. Uh, religious seal. 10 months. 13 months. Cool. Um, put a couple out there to probably deal with some rebels. Beautiful. And now we sit and rest a little. 
That was uh, an intense war. You know, let's be honest, but... I was not sure if we were going to win. <laughs> but we did. In the end, we did. Oh, God. What in the world? <laughs> did you guys hear that awful noise? Alright, we paid off our debt, so that's good. Mothball our forts. We don't have any or we don't have any rebels, I don't think. Uh, Bosnian separate. Yeah, it's not gonna matter. Wait for the reinforcements to get done, and then did I really have no mercs? I thought I had iron mercs that war. That war, I guess I didn't. Hmm. Uh, soon we're gonna do the secure southern Italy thing as well. They're only allied to Great Britain. That's not that bad. Is France at war? With someone they are. Provence. Okay, that's good. Okay, uh, it is time to decide our next idea group. We're definitely going to be taking a um, an admin idea group, I, I think at least. Uh, so what do we want to take? We had been talking about this earlier in the stream today, but uh, religious is good, but so is humanist. I I am I'm still leaning towards. You know what? I think I'm. I think I know what we need to do, because here's the deal. We already have a lot of missionary strength. We already have multiple missionaries. We're going to get more, because soon we're going to have Jerusalem. Um, <clears throat> beyond that, look how, even with only two missionaries, uh, even with two missionaries, we've already been able to keep up with our conversions, right? And that's only going to get better as we get more missionaries. Um, and so, yeah, so that's the thing. We get um, missionary strength. We can already convert anything we come across. We converted Rome, right? Um, so I don't think we're having a problem converting things. I think instead humanist which will actually, you know, it'll make it easier to transition to being able to convert them, you know? It makes it easier to conquer stuff. And the policies, the, one of the policies, uh, one of the things was that the policies for religious, I think, are slightly better. The quality one, morale of army siege ability, that's amazing. The quantity one, morale of armies recover on morale speed, that's also really good. So those are both really good. But uh, the humanist ones are good as well. The quantity ideas one, I don't think is that good. The influence ideas one definitely is worth it. Uh, the influence ideas one is one I'll always take. Because um, it, it's like, if you're going to take an extra relation anyways, it would be minus one, which is what you get from the policy, and you also get reputation, right? Um, yeah. I definitely think that uh, it, they, the policies are not quite as military-focused for humanists that pair with it, but, uh, but they're still good. So I'm definitely going to do it. I'm gonna go ahead and take humanist. I just I just like humanist a lot. And we're when you're conquering a lot of land, it's it helps it integrate in easier. So we're gonna do that and we're gonna say focus this way. Cool. Okay, that's pretty good. I wonder if you're gonna have any rebels. I mean zero unrest. Because I mean it's your cores, it's your land. <laughs> Oh yeah, I think they're gonna be fine. So, uh, if that is the case, let's go over here. Okay. Oh man, I'm so happy we finally got a good tip in the balance, right? Yeah. We're behind on military, but you know, who isn't these days <laughs> in this economy? No. Uh, wait for our reinforcing to be done. Oh, did we eclipse the Mamluks? Also, why do we um? Why are we making so much more money right now than we were before? Like it, it went up by a lot. Oh wow, we did eclipse the Mamluks. Wow. Okay. I mean, that's awesome. That's very helpful. We can rival Aragon, though? <laughs> yeah, right. Okay. Uh, meanwhile, I do actually want to get some claims on Austria, you know? I don't just have these uh, this, this claim stuff for uh, decoration. Okay. I think it's about time to go to war with... Uh, with Aragon. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, we're gonna go to war with Aragon now. We're, look how much money we're making with our army mage and stuff. Forts are down, but still. Adrianople. You know what? F you, game. But also, well, this is fine. I'm, yeah, I'm gonna leave one army over here anyway, so this is good. Uh huh. You want you to go down here? Mm hmm. There you go. Okay. Uh, end of this month, I think. Yeah, next tick. Mm-hmm. Alright. We're about to go to war with Aragon. Mm-hmm. Uh, I cannot do that. Mm-hmm. Oh, man. Still out with Russia there? Yeah, they are. Of course they are. I really just, I hope that we get the P over Russia eventually. Even if it's very late, I don't care. It's still gonna be good. It's still gonna be amazing. Let's go ahead and raise up our forts, because we're gonna be going to war soon here. Did Hungary move their capital back yet? No, I'm surprised they haven't. Normally they, uh, I feel like the AI always does that, even though it costs them. I don't know if it actually costs them points. It might be free for the AI. And I wouldn't, I wouldn't be mad about that. It kind of makes sense, you know. If you're moving back, back to a historical capital that you lost, it makes sense to me. Okay, well, hold on. Let's go and sit in. Uh, wait for there. Okay, so. Definitely, I don't want him to be leading armies. Okay, Philopolis. <laughs> Philopopol Philopopolis? Philopopolis. That's a great name for a province. <laughs> it's a great name. Philopopolis. <laughs> I love that. Um, okay. Philip's city, pretty much. Which actually, that makes sense. That is that like... Is that like maybe where, what is that named after? <laughs> is that named after like Alexander the Great's dad? Because wasn't his dad named Philip and was from Macedonia, which included that area at the time? Is that what that means? I don't know, like that, that's just a complete guess, but maybe it's right, I don't know. Probably isn't. France wouldn't join because they're in debt. Well, hmm. I'd really like you to join France. I'm willing to send you some money. Send you some money, bud. That's probably not gonna make a difference, but might as well see if it does. Nah, it made a little bit of a difference. Huh. Hey, that's nice. Your little gems he That's good. That's good. It's not amazing, but it's good. You know, simple stuff, right? It's the simple things in life. Okay, I think we're going to do this war. Internal conflicts in Burgundy. Hmm. Uh, surprise, surprise. Um, I guess let's go for Salento. Or, I mean, it doesn't matter. None of them have forts or anything. Well, I guess Great Britain being the war does mean that I'd, I'd like to get France in. Yeah, you know what? Okay, never mind. I changed my mind. We're going to actually go back into full money-making mode. Okay. Okay, Golden Era is over. Yep, we knew that was coming at some point. Tunis, by the way. Ooh, I might be able... They have a heart for me. They love me. They're friendly. I wonder if they would be willing to do this. Ooh, they might. They might. Let's let's do two things simultaneously. For one, well, we can't get a claim on them, so never mind. Well, eh, improve relations. That's what we should do. All right. Uh, 
Uh, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do that right now. How long does religious zeal last? Uh, only a couple more years. Not bad. Nope. Never gonna happen. Nope. Never gonna happen. Exemplum. We could probably do. Yep. There we go. Uh, and then we should help out our vassal down here. We should help out you. Okay. Is this where your main, where George's capital actually is? Tbilisi? Yeah, I think that is right. Okay. All right. Tell you what, I'm going to use a restroom real quick. And then we will, I think, go ahead and stream for, you know, another little while. I don't have anything to do tomorrow, so. Um, I mean, nothing time sensitive or anything, so. I'll stream a little while longer. I don't know how many people are watching or anything, but I'll stream for whoever's watching. All right, I'll be right back. <laughs> 